is a special time of year in the European footballing cycle. It's where it all begins again, the lifting of the trophy, the winners' medals. That was all back in May. A mere reminder, a relic of the glory that was and what may be to come, perhaps, for one of these. So what a stage for the players to take to here ahead of such an important game. So it's back, bigger and better than ever before. I do hope everybody is ready for another ride on the emotional roller coaster. Bring it on, Peter. I'm looking forward to a competition that always delivers entertainment, whether through its football or indeed its supporting cast of, of emotions. Neither of these teams will want a, a trip back to the drawing board after this, so I think we can expect something quite lively. Got things on the way. Who do you think this turns on, Jim? Who else but Zlatan Ibrahimovic, capable of executing what others are unlike? That a foul? Yes, the uh, referee's given it. And here's Giroud. That intervention was very necessary. Danger averted for now. Brahim Diaz spreads it towards the left. Real chance! Good try. The outcome could so easily have been different. Uh, that's a little unfortunate. He had a lot of people worried then. Pepe. It's a bit of penetration to go with all this possession. Porto have pushed both fullbacks into quite advanced positions here. Yeah, that's that's interesting. So what are they attempting to do? Well, it's it's a bold at Porto have a free kick. Kessier. Oh, that's clearly not what he wanted to do. Bakayoko. Out to the right. And here's Ibrahimovic. And he has been fouled there. And he's going to have his name taken. Brahim Diaz. That's gone a long way up and away. Kessier. Neither side yet able to find the net. And here's Giroud. Brahim Diaz. Timely intervention. Well, I don't think it was the wisest option, Peter, once he got into that position. It's not as if... He didn't have people nearby. So 
done very well to intervene. Giroud. Brahim Diaz. Back to the keeper and go again. Keeper's got good distance on that. He's making good use of his strength there, just refuses to be out-muscled. The first 45 minutes are up. They both sides have drawn blanks and have toiled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. It's the first half compared with your expectation. Yeah, the scoreline doesn't tell the whole story as one side has been significantly better, at least defensively. And after 45 minutes, it is still goalless change perhaps after half time but we're already into the second period Milan playing well with lots of opportunities and plenty positives to take from the first half despite this scoreline converting chances would make a world of difference for them now it's Ibrahimovic Ibrahimovic goes looking gets it upfield Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Now it's Giroud. Well oh, read, he sorted that out. Plays it out to the wing. It's found its way to him. Finds himself eased off the ball. For a moment you felt that was going somewhere, but they'll have to go again. Kessier. He's picked him out. Has a hit! Back of the net! And late in the day, a telling moment. And that is about as cool as they come. He picked his spot expertly. Now that's what I call finishing, right in the corner. He knew instinctively who was where and didn't need to waste any time weighing things up. That's a cracking goal. Porto take the lead. Yeah, I had a feeling this was coming. Still, there's a fair bit of time if you're going to think about defending it now. Clears it out of harm's way. What a throw in. Bakayoko. Castillejo. Look at the defender bombing forward. Cut out in the nick of time. Milan are actually displaying tremendous fighting spirit. There's a real belief that they can still have a say. Giroud. Oh, he's in! Going for goal! And that could come back to haunt them. Oh, that could prove a pivotal moment in this match. They needed that goal badly, you know. Porto are able now to make their substitution. It's been on the cards for uh, a few moments now. Well, he's worked so hard for his side, uh, as you would expect, but you couldn't help notice that he was starting to, to labour a bit, so it's no surprise. Jard battles to win it back. Porto can afford to settle on seeing this one out by running down the clock, I think. Now it's Ibrahimovic. Hoists it forward. Knocks it away. 
Referee looks at his watch and blows his whistle. So the first game is lost and there is ground to be made up. The margin for error significantly reduced. Your final thoughts, Jim? Well, it's the start they didn't want, but it doesn't have to mean there's no chance of recovery.